you guys know my dad is Mr. Brightside? <sighs> yeah, unfortunately my dog assassinated my mailman the other day. Because now I have to deliver all my mail by owl, and owls are natural predators. So every time an owl comes and drops off my mail, picks up one of my cats and runs off with it. I have 72 of those stupid things anyway, so it doesn't matter. I can eat tape like no problem. Yeah, the teacher said I'm technically so smart that I should be in college, but she was like, well, let me actually keep you around to help me teach these idiot kids. Yeah, the other day my dad put a patent on the alphabet, and uh, people at the patent office were like, okay, I'm kind of surprised nobody has figured that out yet. <laughs> now, and every time anyone uses letters, they got past like 17 cents or something, so we're gonna get rich here soon. You guys ever heard of the song Cotton Eye Joe? That song was based off of my life. Don't ask me how, but I've seen the Ark of the Covenant on like four separate occasions. Face didn't even melt off or anything like that movie. Honestly, it made my face feel better. My mom made out with Barney from Barney. My dad is Adam, like from Adam and Eve. Oh wait, crap, that means I have to have sex with my sister. My doctor diagnosed me with a clinical case of being too sassy. I was like, what, girlfriend? No way. <laughs> Just kidding. They diagnosed me with cancer and they said I have 15 minutes to live. Oh wait, crap. So this morning, I saw the lunch lady barf all over the school lunch and she was like, don't tell anybody. This is my secret ingredient. And I was like, what the heck are you doing? And she's like, don't, uh, and then she winked at me. And I was like, okay, weird. <laughs> I guess my dad is technically Seth Rogen and Seth MacFarlane. Don't ask me how. My mom is big pharma. <laughs> <coughs> Guinness World Records is essentially just a scrapbook of my life. Yeah, I used to be in Beatles band, but then they kicked me out because I punched Paul McCartley too much. <sighs> my mom invented the guitar. My doctor said I'm medically confusing. This hot girl is kissing had herpes, but I was so good at kissing that I sucked all her herpes off her face and I just ate them. Guess what? Miss Taylor gave me permission to pick my nose in class and everybody else's nose. Yesterday, I accidentally discovered my backyard is technically a sovereign nation. So my middle name is Parcheesi. Yeah, the other day I swear to God I saw the lo-fi hip hop girl look right at me in the face and, and start screaming. Did you guys know that my behavior is extremely manageable both in the classroom and in public? Should I try or despise all my time till I die? Don't know why I'm so tired to making my decisions based on you.